Good morning, folks. We've got a look at the sun, sunspots, the next three and 5.9 month cycle upticks, and a paper that furthers the rapid electrodynamic forcing power of the sun on the Earth. We'll be starting with our star and the GOES SUVI images. Southern coronal hole turning away, smaller equatorial coronal hole turning in. We have seen only minor motions at the active regions and they do not appear to have released CMEs. Solar flaring remains low, but we've got another day of watching these sunspots as their potential to erupt remains. It is worth noting that despite their presence, we are now coming out of the uptick period expected on the sun. The approximately 3 and 5.9 month cycle uptick phase which hit in late February and early March should be beginning to wane back. We shouldn't expect a complete lack of activity over the coming weeks, but the next 3 and 5.9 month cycle upticks aren't expected until about June and August, respectively. Hopefully, we will get a bit of a break from the inclement space weather conditions that have endured over the last several weeks. Today's top story hits the rapid, immediate electrical impact of space weather. We are getting confirmation of the midpoint layer interaction between solar storm impact and the ionosphere a direct and immediate impact. This is crucial because it helps elucidate the processes that lead to the fast forcing that has been seen before and which we described in our latest book. Instantaneous, light speed, immediate forcing of space weather events on the entire globe, often through the ionosphere. And once again, this works the global electric circuit, which spans the ionosphere to the ground, to play with the clouds, precipitation, direct heating, pressure cell modulation, and wind speeds. Grab a copy of our latest book, The Observer Supplement, at the link below the video, along with links to our other publications, websites, and more. We greatly appreciate your support. Subscribe, and we'll do this all again tomorrow. Right here, but right now, at 7.30 a.m. in Charlotte. Eyes open. No fear. Be safe, everyone.